in this question first we shall find the uh, we shall find the mod mean of the given data so let's say this column is for age of patients in in telework form so let's write age in years 5 to 15 years 15 to 25 years 25 to 35 years 35 to 45 years and 45 to 55 years and 55 to 65 years uh, let's say this is this column is for xi and uh, when whenever the xi is given in interval form xi can be calculated actual xi can be calculated by up average of upper limit and lower limit divided by 2 so here 5 plus 15 divided by 2 will be 10 here 20 30 40 50 and 60 number of patients is nothing but the corresponding frequ num frequency to the xi so number of p patient let's say it is fi the corresponding frequency um, corresponding to xi so it is 6 11 21 23 24 sorry it is 14 and 5 so i am going to find the uh, mean by the uh, assumed mean methods in assumed mean method we choose any one value of xi as assumed mean so here i am choosing assumed mean 30 so let's say a equals to assumed mean and i am choosing uh, we, uh, you can choose any value from the xi table xi column so assumed mean equals to 30 and uh, we shall find the deviation from the assumed mean let's say it is di deviation from each xi to the value 30 a where a is 30 in this question so 10 minus 30 will be minus 20 20 minus 30 will be minus 10 30 minus 30 is 0 40 minus 30 10 and it will be 20 and 30 now this this column is for fi into di since in assumed mean method mean is equal to a plus summation fi di by summation fi so we need to calculate summation fi di so first we shall we shall get the product of fi each fi and di so this column is for fi and this column is for di so corresponding products will be 6 into minus 120 minus 20 it will be one minus 120 minus 110 230 here it is 0 and here 280 and here 150 so now we can calculate the summation fi and summation fi di summation fi will be sum of all fi and summation fi di will be sum of all fi di so this will be 80 and this will be 430 so here value of a is 30 so 30 plus 430 divided by 80 so if i solve this i'll get this will be 8 times this will be 43 times so this will be 35.375 or i can say 35.38 mean uh, here mean 
द मीनिंग ऑफ मीन इन गिवन इक्वेशन इज द ऑन एन एवरेज एज ऑफ वन पेशेंट इज थर्टी फाइव पॉइंट थ्री एट ईयर्स नाउ वी शेल कैलकुलेट द मोड ऑफ द गिवन डाटा सो हियर इन दिस क्वेश्चन वी कैन सी दैट फॉर मैक्सिमम नंबर ऑफ पेशेंट्स आर एज बिटवीन थर्टी फाइव टू फोर्टी फाइव सो आई कैन से दैट the maximum class frequency is 23 for age between so age between 35 to 45 so i can say for class 35 to 45 years so model or model class will be 35 to 45 years 35 to 45 now mode of any observation is given by l plus f1 minus f0 divided by 2 f1 minus f0 minus f2 multiply by h and as i will describe all the variable Uh, one by one. So uh, L is the nothing but lower limit of model class. So uh, lower limit of model class is given thirty five, since model class is thirty five to forty five, and F one, F one is the frequency. of model class and frequency of model class is given 23 so f1 will be 23 now f0 is the frequency of preceding class of model class so F not is given by the uh, frequency of class before the model class. Before the model class, the class is twenty five to thirty five, and its corresponding frequency is twenty one. So F not will be twenty one. Now F one, F one is the frequency after the model class. Uh, is the frequency of the class after the model class which is 45 to 55 and its corresponding frequency is 14 so f1 sorry f2 will be frequency of uh, class 45 to 55 this will be 14 and h is the nothing but interval or i can say class size so class size interval is of 10 45 to 35 so h will be 10 if i put all value here i will get l equals to 35 plus f1 is 23 minus f0 is is 21 divided by 2 into 23 minus 21 minus 14 into 10 So this will be thirty-five plus two into ten divided by. It will be forty-six minus thirty-five. So if I solve this, I'll get mod equals to mod will be thirty-six point eight years. So mod. represents the 
मैक्सिमम नंबर ऑफ पेशेंट वाज एज ऑफ सॉरी एज ऑफ थर्टी सिक्स पॉइंट एट ईयर्स